I'm Aisha, you are watching Educational Hub. When it comes to research, in the field of business, economics, psychology, sociology, biology, etc., the analysis of variance, shortly known as ANOVA is an extremely important tool for analysis of data. There is a two-fold purpose of ANOVA. In one way ANOVA the researcher takes only one factor, as against, in the case of two-way ANOVA, the researcher investigates two factors concurrently. What is one-way ANOVA? One-way analysis of variance, ANOVA, is a hypothesis test in which only one categorical variable or single factor is considered. It is a technique which enables us to make a comparison of means of three or more samples with the help of F distribution. It is used to find out the difference among its different categories having several possible values. One-way ANOVA is based on the following assumptions. 1. Normal distribution of the population from which the samples are drawn. 2. Measurement of the dependent variable is at interval or ratio level. 3. Two or more than two categorical independent groups in an independent variable. 4. Independence of samples. 5. Homogeneity of the variance of the population. What is two-way ANOVA? Two-way ANOVA as its name signifies, is a hypothesis test wherein the classification of data is based on two factors, for instance, the two bases of classification for the sales made by the firm is first on the basis of sales by the different salesmen and second by sales in the various regions. Assumptions of two-way ANOVA as, 1. Normal distribution of the population from which the samples are drawn, 2. Measurement of dependent variable at continuous level. 3. Two or more than two categorical independent groups in two factors. 4. Categorical independent groups should have the same size. 5. Independence of observations. 6. Homogeneity of the variance of the population. The differences between one-way and two-way ANOVA can be drawn clearly on the following grounds. 1. Meaning. Hypothesis test that enables us to test the equality of three or more means simultaneously using variance is called one-way ANOVA, a statistical technique in which the interrelationship between factors, influencing variable can be studied for effective decision-making, is called two-way ANOVA. 2. Independent variables. There is only one factor or independent variable in one-way ANOVA. Whereas in the case of two-way ANOVA there are two independent variables. 3. Compares. One-way ANOVA compares three or more levels, conditions, of one factor. On the other hand, two-way ANOVA compares the effect of multiple levels of two factors. 4. Number of observation. In one-way ANOVA, the number of observations need not be same in each group whereas it should be same in the case of two-way ANOVA. Thank you for watching. I hope you can easily understand difference between one-way ANOVA and two-way ANOVA. Like share and subscribe my channel for more informative videos about research.